It was the last regular season game for the Husky football team on Saturday. The challenge they faced, trying to beat an undefeated Maverick team. On the line was the coveted traveling training kit. Enough suspense, let's go right to the highlights. All right, into the first, 135 left. Derek Stripling with a nine-yard run for Husky's first touchdown. Puts them up six to, no, six to nothing. They missed that extra point, but we'll jump in. 634 into the first. Julianne Phipps for Mankato. He will get a one-yard touchdown run for Mankato's first touchdown. Puts a score at seven to six. Now nearly four minutes remaining in the first. Tyler Allery. Uh, Derek Stripling will find Tyler Allery in the end zone. Eight yard touchdown catch. Puts the score at 13 to 7 SCSU and into the second quarter. Stripling again. His second touchdown, this time a one yard TD run. Aldridge kicked the extra point. Puts the score at 20 to 7. St. Cloud State's up. Now Julian Phipps again with a 15 yard touchdown run. His second. Puts the score at 20 to 14. SCSU taking a solid lead, but Jake Aberg with a seven yard touchdown run. He'll put this at a very close game, 20 to 21. But in the fourth quarter, with just a minute remaining, a three yard touchdown from Dante Stewart. Huskies win that one, 26 to 21. Derek Stripling was 11 for 22 with 150 yards and a touchdown. Dante Stewart had 11 carries and 35 yards and a two t and one TD. Also, the Huskies pull off what many people thought would be a blowout game. And the traveling training kit comes home to St. Cloud once again. For those of you who are not aware of the training kit tradition, it's a red and purple kit that the winning team takes home. The tradition of playing for the kit dates back to 1978 and was named the second most bizarre college football rivalry trophy on an ESPN top 10 list.